Hi friends how are you all? Welcome to my WS Cube Tech YouTube channel. In this video we will learn how to import HTML template in Laravel project. So let's get started. Create a new folder name anything you want. I will name it Laravel HTML. After creating the folder, open it in VS Code by right click and select open with VS Code. Or you can drag and drop the folder in VS Code. After this, we will run a command for creating a new Laravel project by opening a new terminal. The project is creating. It will take some time. Depends on your system. It's my humble request to all viewers, please like the video, subscribe to the channel, and share the video with your friends. I'm fast forwarding the video so that we can save time. The project has been created successfully. Now, we will move all the files to the root folder because Laravel creates a directory inside the specified folder during project creation. Therefore, we need to be in the root directory. Now you can see we are in root directory. We will run the command in the terminal. PHP artisan serve. This will start the server, allowing us to run our project in the browser. Click on follow the link it will redirect you in browser. You can see that our project is running successfully in the browser. In the next step, we will import an HTML template into our newly created Laravel project. As you can see, I already have a template. First, I will show you this template in HTML by clicking on index.html so you can see it open in the browser. Afterward, we will proceed to use the same template in our project. For this, we will create a folder named frontend inside the public folder of our Laravel project. We'll paste all CSS and JavaScript files into this folder. However, we won't copy-paste the HTML file directly into the public folder. So as you see now all our files are pasted in front-end folder. In the next step, we will create a blade file inside the resources slash views folder. Then, we'll copy all the HTML code from index.html and paste it into index.blade.php file. You can open the HTML file in any text editor. I will open it in the Windows default text editor notepad. In the next step, we will update the root and change welcome.blade.php to index.blade.php file so that we can access our index file on the home page. Let's refresh the page and wait for the result. Apologies for the oversight regarding index.blade.php, I think we have not saved the file after pasting the code so, let's save the file and try accessing it again. Now, while the HTML page is displaying, but we're missing the CSS and JavaScript loading, in the next step, we'll link the CSS and JavaScript files into our index.blade.php using Laravel's URL method. This method allows us to access the public folder. We'll define the file paths within curly braces for each file. Let's proceed to link all the files in this manner.
so we have done. Let's refresh the page and wait for the result. Alright, we've successfully linked the CSS files. However, the JavaScript linking hasn't been completed yet. Let's follow the same process as we did for the CSS files to link the JavaScript files. Great! It's good to see that the template is now working properly with our JavaScript. In the next step, we'll continue by linking all our resources, such as images. We'll use the same approach we used for linking CSS and JavaScript files, by providing the URLs using Laravel's URL method. Let's proceed with linking all the images in a similar manner. Great! It's fantastic to hear that all the images are loaded and working properly. I'm glad the tutorial was helpful to you. If you found it useful, please consider liking the video and subscribing to the channel. See you in the next video? Goodbye and happy coding with WS Cube Tech.